Hi, Scorpio. So this is going to be your fourth one, okay? So make sure that you, if you haven't already, taken the time to go look at the other ones that are already out, okay? All right, Scorpio. Let's see here. What are we talking about now? With my Scorpio. Oh, <laughs> I'm sorry. I don't know what that is. I didn't get a chance to see it. But let me try to shuffle it like this. Give me one second, Scorpio. Let's see. Omar is going to be significant, okay? So somebody's name, somebody named Omar is gonna, oh, three minutes, um, um, three months, three minutes, three is significant, will be contacting you. Somebody's driver is going to be named Omar. Somebody's like taxi driver is going to be named Omar is what they're showing me. So this may be the reason why you need to pay attention to this message is what I'm hearing. All right, here we go, Scorpio. It took forever, but we got here. Bottom of the deck is, I want you to tell the world about our love. I want you to tell the world about our love. Tell me what's on your mind. May is significant. I only want something casual. Can we talk tonight? Uh-oh, somebody want more. They want more. They thought this was all they want. They want more. They came in with the casual bit, but they don't want that now. They want more. It may be significant. They could be a Taurus or a Gemini. Oh, wait, I forgot. Um, they may send you a good morning text. Can we talk tonight after work is what I'm getting. They could, like I said, they could send you a good morning text and and say, hey, um, I've been thinking about you. Can we, um, you know, um, talk tonight, you know? Their birthday could be in May. Or y'all was chilling the whole month of May. You know what I mean? Like, um, what's going on here, Spirit, please? Darkest. Oh, they're afraid. That's why. So they may have felt something from the very, excuse me, the very, excuse me, I got to drink some water. They, were, they may have felt something from the very beginning with you, Scorpio. And, um started to say that this is casual, you know, try to put the casual mark on it, giving and receiving. And then, oh, this person is the, like they could be an emperor. All right, so um, in the beginning, they could have wanted something only um, uh, casual with you. And it feels like, they only wanted something casual because they were scared of what they were feeling. That's what it feels like to me. That's what it feels like to me. Like, what was their darkest fear? I feel like falling in love with you. That's what I feel. I feel like falling in love with you ended up being this person's darkest fears and they're not typically afraid of anything Scorpio strength that would be you know um like the straight the uh, Leo's card okay um <laughs> 
you prove I, I laugh like that to not laugh at the situation. It's like, huh, like that, like a, huh, you know, so don't take that the wrong way. Um, you came in and somebody got really afraid and they want something, they wanted something serious. King of Swords. So they had to pull back Seven of Cups. They started to imagine a life with you. Bottom of the deck is Seven of Pentacles, long-term investment. It told you, retirement, investment, maturing, perseverance. And see, on this card, it says compassion, sacrifice, healing, resilience, bravery, and courage. And I feel like they pulled back and started to go logical with it because of what they were feeling. Wishful thinking. Wonder why this person... Am I asking? Do I? Okay, yeah, I am. All right, Spirit. Why Why? Why they felt the need to pull back, Spirit? Why they felt the need to pull back? Why they feel the need to pull back? Okay, here we go. Page of Pentacles. Because they saw something. It says grooming for success. They saw something. The hermit. I told you they pulled back. I'll make this up, y'all. Y'all know this by now. Knight of Cups. Oh my gosh, Scorpio. You know what? This person tried to this person started to feel something for you immediately. Immediately. And that makes sense with Scorpio's energy because that's always been you'll see three of wands. They felt something for you immediately. The death card. That's your energy. See, Ace of Pentacles, wishful thinking, going straight into real, feeling like this could be life changing. And then the bottom of the deck is the sun. Scorpio, you immediately made this person feel like there is something here. I have like flowers in here. And so it's going to collect um, like little gnats and stuff. So I have to go and spray them. Um Joy, freedom, enthusiasm, uh, good luck, gratitude, self-expression, and pregnancy. So I feel like they may have pulled back and only gave you a little bit of their time. And it was strategic on their part. But you could have felt like something was more there. Else was there. And they were pulling back because of dot dot dots. You could have you could have felt all of that. So if you're clarifying the giving and receiving, please. Here we go. They want you to tell them what's on their mind, but on your mind. But I feel like um, they're gonna tell you. So just sit and listen. Eight of Wands. That's communication. That's fast movement. So immediately they felt something. It says fast movement, energetic, exciting times, um, infatuation, impulsive results. I told you they were being very, they had to pull back to be very, that's why the hermit came out to pull back, right? To be very strategic on how they moved with you because they felt something for you immediately. So that scared them. Four of Cups immediately. Daydreaming, fantasizing, missed opportunity and regret. They had to have you in their life somehow. Collaborating with you. Told you, this is the three of Pentacles. They had to have you in their life somehow. Some of you, this may be a Capricorn. Um, or Leo, you have the devil here. And they could have felt themselves starting to obsess over you. And the Eight of Swords can't stop thinking about you. Feeling like you sort of took, hi daddy, you sort of taken some sort of control over them. Queen of Pentacles, um, businesswoman, philanthropic, uh, uh, luxury, healer, successful, well known and wealth. It's like you could have had some sort of, they felt like you had some sort of hold of them where they were not able to be in this energy. Or find the lead card here. I feel like now they're like, mm -mm, I want to be this, you know, to my Scorpio. I want to be in 
Scorpio's life more. I don't want just a casual situation anymore. Judgment. Yep, they would. They woke up to this. It's like it says decisive, not indecisive, decisive. And it's of course it's going to come out with the emperor. The emperor is very decisive. Okay, so um, that's what I'm getting. The um, seven of swords. No more lying to themselves and releasing the idea of control with the four of pentacles, the three of swords. I feel like this when this came out, I immediately got, if I have to hurt, I have to try this. If this ends in a heartbreak, I have to still try this. I'm not going to, I don't want my trauma to continue to keep me from having this. They desire you. Mm. Queen of Swords, you're guarded. You're a bit guarded. They know they have to get past this exterior. This no nonsense type of person. See, to get to the two of cups. Mm. Yep, Scorpio, they want you. Six of pentacles. They want to do more than this is the six of pentacles of this deck. This is the six of pentacles here. I got to get the next three. And it's the four of swords, the three of cups. And the Ten of Wands. So this to me is that they're not going to make any things any more difficult because they don't want to miss out. It's 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 going to be stressful on them because they're scared. Just know that because you took you. I don't think they've ever felt your ener anybody's energy like that before. You're different. Embrace. I can't make this up. Embrace. They're embracing this. Believe and succeed. They believe that they can have something with you. Healing begins and seek. So they're going to go within first, though, Scorpio. So maybe this may be a Virgo or an Aries. They're going to go within first. Yep. Page of Swords, Ace of Cups. And then they're coming with you. Wow, these are my confessions. The Seven of Cups. They're coming towards you once they learn what they need to learn. Because on the Page of Swords, it says curious, intelligent, tech savvy, calculated, quick learner, delayed news, patient, and direct. And then they're coming with this Ace of Cups. New love, relationship, romance, joy, conception, fertility, celebration, and the Ace of Swords, communication, truth, authority, new contracts, and victory. So it's like... As soon as they come out of Hermit Boat, some of you, this is going to happen around um, August, September. But as soon as they get out of that, you guys should be good. Roll with it. If that's something that you want or willing to wait for, it's up to you, though. Love you guys. I'll see you guys with another one. So look for it. Message.